Hello, everybody. Welcome to the win and the... Willow! Sorry because we're, we always be late for story time and we sometimes forget. We sometimes forget? Yeah! We didn't forget. It was Christmas and then it was New Year's. We haven't been here in a couple weeks. But now we forgot about... But then it wasn't a holiday anymore. It's not a holiday today. And... And then we forgot about it, and then we did it. <laughs> and now we're here. Yeah. Should we sing hello? I thought maybe I can, 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 I have a little hand thing that I made yesterday. And I was hoping that I could um do this for story time. A hand song? A that could be fun. Oh, you can say hello with your hand. I get it. Excellent. up one too. kind of hand today. And I'm going to put a, uh, a, pen, a pencil and then go, um, put a tape over it and then this time I can hold the stick. Oh, put a stick on it? I love that idea. And then I can wave it with the stick. Maybe you'll see that completed project next week. We have a book for you today. Willow, where's the book we picked? Did you hide it? Uh, uh, what? Eh. Where did you put it? You dropped it. I dropped it. I dropped it. Oh, our how about we need to drop it? How about the willow and the wind? The willow and the wind. Wait, I'm win. Yeah, we going to switch it. Oh, this book, I did forget to flip my camera today, didn't I? <laughs> this book is called Evelyn Del Rey is Moving Away. Can and I, it's by can Meg I, Medina can I, and illustrated by Sonia Sanchez. And I'm going to read it, but you can help me read it. And you have another book to read too, right? So let's see. I think it's too late to flip my camera. Oh, well. Well, Evelyn Del Rey is moving away. Evelyn Del Rey is my mayor amiga, my numero uno best friend. Come play, Daniela, she says, just like she always does. Just like today is any other day. 
Do you have a best friend? My best friend is Celia and Kira. Mm. My really best friend. They're your best friends? Do Maybe I all know. of you can think about who your best friend is. Sometimes we have a bunch of best friends. It I know could I be do. me. It could be Willow. She could be your best friend. I could be your best friend. That would be fun. Well, Evelyn Del Rey is this little girl's very best friend. And I'll show you the picture here. There they are together. Um, I like her hair better than her hair. They both have pretty cool hair. So I bundle up and I cross the street. A big truck with its mouth wide open. is parked at the curb ready to gobble up Evelyn's mirror. Gobble, 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 gobble. And the stickers around the edge, her easel for painting on rainy days, and the sofa that we bounce on to get to the moon. And there's the big truck with its mouth wide open. And all the boxes, do you see the mirror? I don't see it. There it is, right there. Right there. And the easel. She's waiting for me inside the iron doors. So we climb the steps two at a time, just like we always do. Can you climb the steps? Boom, boom, boom. Two at a time, all the way up to the tippy, 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 tippy top. And there they are, best friends. We sneak past grouchy Mr. Miller's door and wave, hi, Mr. Sue, who's feeding the pigeons in the hall window. Senora Flores gives us each a cookie and says, Today is the big day when we walk by. And there she is. See? Giving them a each a cookie. It looks like mm. kind of like a pigeon food, but like, like okay. pigeon food? Well he's giving Mr. Miller and Mr. Sue are feeding the pigeons. And Senora Flores is giving the cookies. Delicious. Our apartments are almost twins, just like us. That's why I already knew all the good places for hide and seek and the spot behind the heater where we keep our special finds. Fine. Do you have a special place in the house where you keep your special things? Do you have a secret place? Mm -mm. I have a secret space. You do have a secret space? Are you going to tell me or it's too secret? It's, it's a secret and I don't want to tell you. Okay, it's a, I guess it wouldn't be a secret if you told me. Well, there they are. And they've got their secret hiding place behind the radiator. And look at all those boxes. Hmm. Hmm. But the walls in Evelyn's room are sunny yellow, while mine are pink, like cotton candy. And I live with my mommy and hamster, and she has a mammy, a pappy, and a cat. Meow. We are mostly the same, just like our apartments. But not after today. Hmm. Ooh. There's their apartments, sunny yellow and cotton candy pink. And here's... Their slip, their zip line, and you're putting, and her is putting her doll and zipping Zip. it. Zip across to the other apartment. How fun. We find a still empty box near the door, and in no time, I'm the bus driver steering us all over the city. We play until the tables that were bus stops are gone, and the beds that were skyscrapers have vanished too. And we, when we look around, everything has disappeared. Everything has disappeared. Everything except for us. And there they are, playing with all of the boxes. Bus driver. And there they are after everything has disappeared. Oh, no. Uh -oh. What? Uh -oh. Soon the truck outside rumbles off. <laughs> And there's a knock on the door. Hide, we say giggling. Quick, hide. Just like we always do. But our mothers see us. And before we can slip away, they say, time to 
go. Time to go. There they are trying to hide behind the boxes. But the mamas see them. Just like the truck outside. Mm -hmm. There's a truck outside right now, isn't there? Yeah. Evelyn and I hold hands in that wide, empty space, and we lean back, and we start to spin in circles faster and faster and faster and faster until everything is a blur around us. Our fingers slip, but we don't let go until we wobble to the floor. floor. We can talk every day after school, I tell her, though the world is still whirring. And you can visit me this summer, she says, and spend the night. The night, yes. And there they are, spinning, spinning, spinning. And there they are, just chatting about their plans for the summer. Because I think Evelyn Del Rey is... But I know that tomorrow, everything will be different. Evelyn will be in a new home that doesn't match mine. And there she is. Do you see Evelyn? There's Evelyn. There's Evelyn. Before we leave, I spot something in the corner left behind in the dust. It's the last of Evelyn's sparkly stickers. Um, mommy. Go ahead. We go downstairs and I press right here a heart on her cheek to seal our promise. And then she does mine, just the same. And there they are, pressing hearts and butterflies <laughs> onto their cheeks. And oh my goodness, I think, look at that, a sticker on my cheek, a musical note. Let me get one for your cheek. Ready? Come here. Turn your head a little bit. <laughs> there it is. Stickers on our cheeks, just the same. We say patata while mommy takes a photo. Mm. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I hope I am. We do our secret handshake one more time. Secret handshake. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta work on that. And then Evelyn hugs me hard. And there they are doing their secret handshake and giving a great big hug. hug. Evelyn Del Rey is moving away. Away. And there's it is. She won't be right here anymore. There she is getting into her car. She won't be right here anymore. Mommy says not to be sad, that we'll both make new friends. But when Evelyn waves one last time, the sticker still on her cheek, I know she will always be my first mayor amiga, my numero uno best friend. friend. And there they are, saying goodbye. What do you think? Do they look, do they look happy? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. What, what do you think they're feeling? Sad. They're feeling kind of sad, yeah. But she knows that she'll always be her numero uno best friend. The one I will always know by heart. And here she is. All grown up. And look at that. It looks like they're still best friends. And maybe they're even... Pen pals. Just like my pen pal. Yep, who may be watching our stores. Maybe. Pen pal Wesley. Snip, snap, snap. This tail is out. And I have a short little moving kind of song. And then Willow, I think you have one too, right? Um, I was going to read my story first. Oh, you can read a story too. I'm going to sing a quick moving song. If you want to go find your story, you can. I'm this song, I only know a little bit of this, but we can work on it together. It goes like this, and then you can read that book. You ready? Landlord said this morning to me, give me your key, this lot ain't free. I can't get no rent out of you, so pack up your bags and skidoo. Because it's moving day, moving day. Get your carpets up off the floor. Get on your roof, and get out the door, because back and get away. You can spend every cent and go living in a town because it's moving day. Hi Timothy, I'm glad
glad you're here. Willow, do you want to grab an instrument to play with this song? Here we go. The landlord said this morning to me, give me your key. This lot ain't free, oh, I can't get no rent out of you. So pack up your bags and skidoo. Here she comes. National Kazoo Day is coming up pretty soon. We got to keep our eye out for that. I've been practicing on my my. I I've been pretty great at doing um um kazoos. Yeah, I think so. And yeah. you're also learning a little piano, little violin, little nickel harpa, and a, and a ukulele. Ukulele, yeah, learning all sorts of things. Okay, did you want to read them a story now? I read a story and I sang a song. I, do you want to read a story or do you want to make up a song? We probably only have time to do one of those things. I want to do my story. Okay, go ahead. I think I, I, think I want to take off my you sticker. You can take off your sticker. That's no problem. All right, Willow is going to read you a story that she picked out. Tell them what it's called. Um, I'm going to make up the name. All right, you make up the name. I'll be right back. Okay, Willow? All you, bud. It's a snowy day. All right, go ahead. It was snowing on a cold day. What a cold day. What a really, really cold day. Oh, it does look cold. There's the Come out, Dan Lena. It's snowing. There's Dan Lena. The doctor. Come out, Dan Lena. Come out. Drink, she said. Day. Bruce pin pals. But they were also friends. Pen pals and friends. There's his pole going for the uh, Edith. There's Edith. Yeah. There's the dog. And there's what comes next? And Let's have some fun in the snow, said Danielina. There's much, much more. And also, they loved, but there was snow in the attic, and they were in the attic. Uh, snow in the attic? Oh, no. Uh-oh. It was too cold. <laughs> 
<gasps> so today we're looking for the man and the woman with their sleigh with their horses and their blanket. Oh, and they they, the four they were, they saw. Let's show you the place. Yep. Where they are in the attic, digging up the snow in the attic. In the attic? Yeah. All that snow is in their attic? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm glad I don't live there. Nope. That's where I go. <gasps> and the food, their eyes, they with the man and woman with their sleigh with blankets. They waved at them. Hello. They, they stopped the sleigh. Boom. Boom, boom. She said. So they run up to the man and woman to tell them what was their problem. Mm. She said. Our snow is in our attics, he said. Mm, go this way. Oh, gears in the main room. Hey, are. You showed them that one. Keep going. They took off. Father was and the woman. They brought the dog on the sleigh, just like them, and they followed the man and the woman. There they go, off into the snow. They are. And they're slaying, but they are following them. They had fun with the man and woman better. Look at them. The dog's making tracks. Oh, and. Yeah. Oh, and When I say it's time to turn the page. I can make a sound? Yeah! All right, here we go. Turn the page. There they are. The tracks in there. They are making go back. Yeah. Turn the page. Turn the page. <laughs> they hop on a big sleigh and the dog... They think their dog fall to sleep. There they are, there they are. And hold on tight, said them. Sled, they said. Swoo. Hold on tight. They, they walked up the the hill with the ice skates. And the dog was coming down to meet them. And then they sat down the hill. And the dog, they knocked the dog over. And, they, and the dog tumbled over into the sky. The Watch out! And they... She flipped over. Oh no, down we go. And then they were like, get up, get up, she said. Yeah. They like to build a icicle. There they are. There they are building. Let's have a picnic in our fort. The, the, the dog ate some bread and also they ate sandwiches. Mm. There they are. There they are. And we'll be only have one minute left, so you might want to stick to the last page of this one. It's so not. We'll have to finish it next it's, time. Well, it's, well, it's almost the end. Okay, can we speed read? Speed read. They feed it the birds. They fed the birds. Mmm. Mm. They rolled a big 
and the bigger than bum. Uh oh. Oh bum. They stuff it. They put the next bowl on top. It was even bigger than bum. Uh oh. They first they put all the things on it. Soup. What? It was cold. <laughs> the sun came. The first snowman was called Snoot, and Snoot was melting. Oh, now he's melting. Yes. <laughs> the garbella couldn't work. <laughs> No and run to the house. Uh, they put it in the fridge for the next winter. Uh, snip, snap, snap. This tail is out. Bum, ba, da, dum, bum, bum, bum. That's the end of the tale of snow. Nice reading. Na na. Banana soul. Nah, nah, we only have like one minute. Go ahead. To Timothy, goodbye to Carly. Hey, 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 bye, bye. Goodbye to Pop. Good night to Nana. Good night. Hey, hey, hey. Bye, bye. Goodbye to Layla. Goodbye to Leslie. Hey, hey, hey. bye, bye. Goodbye, Penelope. Goodbye to. And to Kira, and to Celie, and to Gizmo, and to Gadget, and everybody. Welcome back to the Wind in the Willow. We'll see you next. No, and I next got, Friday. and I got a joke. Uh, well, we're gonna have to save the joke for next time because Daddy has to teach now. Um, I have a question for. Bye. What? I ha um, I have a notebook for Celie, and you're gonna sleep with me in the tent. That sounds like fun. Bye, everybody. See you next week.